Hey y'all, I'm Elisa, the Scrappy Wife behind ScrappyWife.com and I have a really bright colored box that I cannot wait to open and show you what's inside. Let's go. Could you love this box any more? I'm so excited to open it up. Uh, Stationery Pal reached out to me to see if I would be interested in checking them out, looking at their product. And so I went to their website. Um, they have so many things available. So I was super excited to receive a box from them. Thank you to Stationery Pal for sending me this. And I thought I would show you, I tried to pick kind of an array of things from their website to show you what they have to offer. So many pens, so many stationary items. They have washi, they have stickers, they have just a lot of different things and a lot of them um, in kind of a quirkier, I don't know, not color scheme, but theme, just a lot of really cool things that I think you don't necessarily find other places. And then of course, like I said before, a ton of pens, which will always get me um, very excited. So if you want to see what I have in this box, I'm going to unbox it in this video. I do have an affiliate link and more importantly, a code for you. You can use the code scrappy to save on your stationary pal order um, to save a little extra on top of sales and things like that, that they have going on. All right. Let's unbox. I just love a really cute box. Look at this one. It has, it feels like Care Bears. It feels like a Care Bear box. I'm very excited. Let me open it up. First of all, purple bubble wrap with hearts. Like that is super cute. You get a little thank you note right here. I love it. Look at all the like stationary items on this thank you note. Oh, look at this. Oh my goodness. My kiddos are going to freak out. These are just little bonuses that they send you. Just a little extra, little fun pieces. Those are adorable. Look at that. And then a little duck. I mean, come on. How cute is that? And it smells, it all smells super good, by the way. This is like gorgeous. Okay. So those are some cute little bonuses that they give you. And then look at all the goodies. Okay. I'm going to actually, let's see. I'm going to move some of this to the side. Let's just start. Let's just start kind of pulling things up. So something that I noticed is they had these cool sets of markers. And I think I have, oh, look, another, oh my gosh, look at that. That guy's super funny. Um, I think I had maybe one more, maybe that was it. Okay, I ordered a couple of sets of these pens. So they had these sets of pens, you picked the color. And the idea was that it gave you several pens in your favorite colors. So of course I picked out the purple and look at these. How gorgeous. Let me grab a piece of paper. All right. I have a piece of paper. So this is the purple set. And then you get the deal is you get several pens. This is the brush um, sign pen, which is great for lettering. I love it. And just getting the pens like in your favorite tones, they show you on the website how you can kind of mix and match to make these um patterns and like just use all of these in one tone to draw different oh what is this one propus window oh this is a much lighter purple but then on this side oh look this is a highlighter i was just looking at these a target it's a highlighter that allows you to just see more clearly what you're highlighting. Okay, that's cool. And then the mild liners that we all love. The idea being that maybe you don't use all the colors. Maybe you're wanting to just specialize in certain colors. So I bought the purple one or I picked the purple one and then I'm also picked the black one because um, I can never get enough of black pens. That's probably what I use the most. So let's just quickly sample the black. With the black, you get a Pilot Juice 0.5. Oh, that's a little bit different than the other one. So they're like curating what these look like. Oh, look at this one. Zebra Sarasa. Again, 0.5. Oh, this is gray. This isn't black. This is gray. I bought the gray one. Or I picked the gray one. Pretty. 
Yes. And then this is black. So it's like a mix of black and gray so that you can make different patterns and stuff. Okay. Super pumped about those pens. I always love a good pen. It's always a lot of fun. So I actually ended up picking up you guys a lot of pens because you know, I'm a pen person. This is a Sarasa Mark on zebra highlighter safe. That is what I wanted to see. So I wanted to check and see if it actually was a highlighter safe pen. We'll let that dry for just a second. And then let's just, ooh, let's use our new highlighter, this new window one. Let's see how it does. It didn't run, you guys. Okay, that's cool. That is the Zebra Sarasa Mark On in 0.5. Love that. And then the Sarasa Speedy. Oh, I love this one writes wonderfully. This is supposed to be really quick drying. And let's see how we do with our highlighter on this one. Super well. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I always run into the issue of that the highlighters kind of mess up the pens. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's going to be super cool. Um, I couldn't pass up this one. Look at this adorable pen. I mean, it's like, you guys, I have, I just love cute things. I just do. This one is so adorable. And this is a pencil. Stop it. It's a pencil. Oh my gosh. Oh yes. That's a pencil. Yes, please. And look, it has this here. You can um, attach little charms and things. Love that. I picked up a new set of tweezers, loving these angled tweezers. And my current ones are slightly bent. So these are precise standard tweezers oh, and they're purple and they have a nice feel to them, like a nice grip love. Oh, they're super sharp. So this is kind of like the ones I have and use, except you can see these have been used and loved a lot and they're kind of bent at the top. I'm super pumped. New purple tweezers. What else? Is in oh my goodness. Okay. Washi tape. Like I said, they have a ton of different washi tape. I tried to pick washi tape that had I don't know. That was just a little bit different than what I could just get, you know, from somewhere else. Because I think that's the fun part about shopping some of these online stores is picking up more unique pieces. This is a coffee themed one that I was super excited about. And it looks like little postage stamps, which are just adorable. Let me find the end and then I'll show you how it works. Okay, these are all coffee themed and look how it has like the holes so that you can see and then you just can rip, oh my goodness. And so you can make them, you can just use them like little stamps, just like that. How adorable for a coffee theme spread. Love it. And I love how it has like a pink tone to it. There's a lot on here. Let's see where it starts repeating. Almost right about there. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten different stamped images on there. All coffee postage stamps, which I thought were adorable. Love, love, love those. I don't want to waste any of them. So let's wind this back up. And then I picked out another postage stamp one because I thought that idea was super cool. And I think this one is plant themed. So let's check it out. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, this one is the same kind of idea, but plant themed this time. Let me find the end here. Yep, same idea all gorgeous plants. That's going to be so fun. If you are a junk journaler, let me just say they had a ton of cool kind of ideas and products and things that you could mix into your junk journaling. And I feel like these washi tape stamps are definitely a part of that. Love those. And then this is some more washi tape that I picked up that felt like a nice 
background piece of material. Let me just open this up. Okay, so this is like a washi tape. Let me just pull this sticky back up. It has a sticky back to it. There, okay. So this is like a washi tape, but it's like a paper. So you can, let me just take part of it. You can just tear it. You guys know how I love torn paper and how that looks, but then you pull it off and it's all sticky on the back. So it's super easy for layering in. Oh, I love it. That's going to be awesome for journaling. Just a great background. You get a long roll of it. And I think they had this in different colors as well. I'm super pumped. This is going to be really useful. I love just the different things, things you don't see everywhere else. Okay. What else do we have in here? These are, looks like some brush pens. Let's give this a pack of brush pens. It looks like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten 10 different colors. Oh, that's nice. Okay, it's super juicy. This one would take some getting used to. It's so soft at the tip that it's hard to get the fine lines. But if you like some bolder, I feel like it's meant for just bigger, bigger writing. This would be really hard to do with a fine one. Fabric color. That's awesome. And you get all these different colors in here. Let's just do a quick color swatch to see which ones are in this pack. All right, so 10 colors in that pack. I would say this one, um, you're gonna wanna make sure the fabric color, you're gonna wanna make sure you swatch them because they don't totally match up with the colors that are on um, the edges. This would be great for hand lettering. Like I said, maybe a little bit challenging because they seem to be really soft at the tip. So the like smaller parts are a little bit, a little bit more difficult. And then what, this is a double-sided pen set. Um, that comes in a case, which is always nice. Oh, look at that. These are acrylic, acrylic markers. Let's check it out. Let me get, let's just pick a color. So they don't shake or anything. Let's see how these go. Oh, stop it. It's like a brush pen, but with acrylic paint. Oh my, and this is the different tip. This is kind of the nub tip. Oh my goodness. That's cool. Oh, I'm so excited about these. Oh, let's try a purple. Oh, and let's try this green. I forgot that these were paint pens. This is Nora is what it's called. Oh my goodness, brush lettering, but with an acrylic paint pen. Yes. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, you get so many colors too. This is gonna be perfect in my art journaling. And they're so juicy to get started. this might be what I'm most excited about you guys. These are fabulous. Okay. These are the Nora acrylic arts. You can snap them back in down here. Oh, I like it. Oh, I can't wait to use. This is awesome. 24 different colors. That is super cool. And then one more thing in here. Rosie Posey volume one. Let's see what this is. I think these are all stickers. Create whatever you want. Let me pull this off. 
collage moments of healing material stickers. So this is just a book of stickers. Let's do a quick flip through. It's just kind of some unusual pieces. Again, this screamed junk journaling to me. Oh, here's blue. Different shade of blue. Then into pink. This would have been perfect for a Barbie spread. Pink. Red. Okay. Yellow. How fun is this? Oh my goodness, like a green. Purple. Oh, this one's really pretty. And yeah, these are all. Now, are they stickers? I don't know that they are, you guys. I think these are like collage pieces. Let's just look at them and then I'll take one out. Here's some more blue. It smells like a magazine. It's kind of the feeling I'm getting. Oh, those are gorgeous. And then some letters here at the back and numbers. So let's, there was one that was kind of coming out. Let's just take one out here. This purple one was like making its way out. No, it is a sticker. Okay, good. I thought it was a sticker. That's, we value, that's cute. That's cute. Oh, again, layering, rosy posy, book of stickers. That is so much fun. All right, I'm excited. I'm excited to check out Stationery Pal and see you, they have a ton. They have so much on their website. I will do my best to like link specific things because, because they have so much on their website and can be a little overwhelming to shop and figure out what you want. Take some time to explore over there as you are getting your order ready, but I will link these things. I think I'm, well, I'm excited about a few things. First of all, all of the different pens. Like I love a good pen. I cannot wait to play with these. And then these acrylic paint markers are different and fun and I cannot wait to give them a try. So this I'm pretty excited about. And all of this I think will be really interesting. Like I said, kind of different things. Not so sure about these hand lettering pens, but we'll just see how they work over time. Different hand lettering pens you use for different things. So we'll just see how that goes. All right, like I said before, um, I do have an affiliate link down below to Stationery Pal, and you can use the code SCRAPPY to save extra on your order. Thank you so much for joining me. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Consider hitting that subscribe button as well as the bell notification button. They always have fabulous sales going on. At the time of filming this, there's a back to school sale. There's all kinds of fun stuff. So go check out Stationery Pal. Spend a little time perusing the website. I don't think you will regret it. I want to give a huge shout out to all of my Patreon members. Thank you all so much for all of your support. You are the absolute best. And as always, keep it creative.